All right, viewers, we want to find the value of x in this beautiful exponential equation. Now, the very first thing I want us to do is to remember that 144 can be written as 12 to the power 2, right? Okay, so now let us replace 144 as 12 to the power 2. So we still have x to the x to the 6, which is equal to 12 to the power 2, okay? Now, at this point, I would like us to do something. I would like us to take the sixth power on both sides. So I have here, I would like to take here to the power six and all these guys to the power six, right? Okay. Now, the next thing I want us to remember is that if you have a to the power m, all to the power n, I can go ahead and write these guys as a to the power n, then all to the power m, as if to say you're interchanging the position of m and the position of n. It is very possible because multiplication is commutative, right? Now, so I want to interchange the power of x to the power six and this guy. So I want this guy to go inside and I want x to the power six to be outside. So I have something like this, x to the power six, now all to the power x to the power six, right? And from here, I can go ahead and distribute two and six. So I have 12 to the power 12, right? Because uh, two times six is 12, isn't it? Now you can see that the base here is um, the same as the power. And in the right hand side, the base is the same as the power. So we can now equate each of them. Can I see that conclusively X to the power six is equal to 12, okay? Yes. Now at this point to take away six from this power of X, we take um, the sixth root of both sides. So we have something like the sixth root of this guy and the sixth root of this guy. So this sixth root, we cancel out the power. And now we have X is equal to the sixth root of 12. Or you can better express it in index form as 12 to the power one over six. So this is your solution. And this is the final answer. I believe you'll find value from this video. Please subscribe and God bless you. Bye. See you in the next class.